Hey, what's going on, guys? The Horror Man back discussing an alternate cut of Halloween H2O. Alternate Cuts is the series in which Jason and I discuss alternate versions of various movies. Since it's October, we will be talking about three different Halloween-themed alternate cuts this month. Our first of the three is Halloween H2O, the f Extended Cut. The f Extended Cut of H2O is the version that aired on FX Network. Ultimately, it's an extended version of the movie. This cut contains footage and scenes not available elsewhere. They weren't deleted scenes included on the DVD or Blu-ray, and this version has never officially been released. The only way you could see it was when the movie aired on FX. I was able to obtain this version, so obviously Jason and I do have it in our collections. Otherwise, we wouldn't be discussing it. In its theatrical form, or the final cut of the film, Halloween H2O is the shortest in the franchise, with an approximate runtime of an hour and 26 minutes. This F extended cut runs approximately an hour and 34 minutes. That's an 8-minute difference, and that's a lot when it comes to movies. Now, I'm sure you've all seen Halloween H2O, otherwise you probably wouldn't be watching this video, and I'm sure you've all seen it multiple times. Because of that, I'll simply briefly describe some of the changes to the extended cut. First, in the opening scene, we get more footage of Marion's office after it was ransacked. We know that Michael was looking for Lori's file and that's how he finds her across the country. There are also more shots of Michael stalking Marion in the opening and alternate angles. Not long after that, the rest stop scene is extended. In this version, we actually see Michael peering out of the men's room before the mother and daughter enter. He was watching them as they tried to get into the women's room. It's actually pretty creepy. He's a bit of a pervert in that scene. Later on, there's an extra scene of John and Charlie walking through town to the store. And at one point, Michael drives by. The two friends have a typical discussion among boys. The scene of the students leaving for Yosemite is also extended. My favorite extra scene in the F extended cut is the jack-o'-lantern carving. In the final cut, we see that Will brings a pumpkin to Lori, or Carrie's house, for their date. In a following scene, we see a jack-o'-lantern in the background, so we can surmise they carved it. But in this F extended cut, we get to witness that. I think it's a significant scene, too, specifically because of what is said during it, which I won't spoil but also because it adds to the Halloween atmosphere, which I do feel is lacking in the sequel. Watching Will carve the pumpkin adds another seasonal touch. This sequence is also a great transition into the next conversation Will and Laurie have. I have no idea why the jack-o'-lantern carving did not make the final cut. It should have. Especially since this movie is short anyway, it's not like it would have dragged it out. In fact, I personally feel it makes it flow better. The garbage disposal scene with Charlie is slightly extended. The chase scenes throughout the campus are extended as well. There is extra footage of Lori searching for Michael in the school, before their climactic sibling battle. Lori also takes an extended drive in the coroner's van when she steals Michael's body. And lastly, the F extended cut features the original K&B mask more. 
I know it's an unpopular opinion, but I prefer that mask. This is a situation where I think more is more. I prefer the F extended cut to the theatrical version. The extra eight minutes do not negatively affect the pacing at all, and as I said, I actually think it flows better. In the end, it still only has a runtime of just 94 minutes. This is definitely my preferred version of Halloween H2O. But the cool thing about both versions existing is the fact that we have alternate cuts. Please be sure to check out Jason's video to hear what he has to say about Halloween H2O, the F Extended Cut. Have you seen Halloween H2O on FX? If so, what do you think of it? And which of the additional scenes is your favorite? Comment below and let me know. Which Halloween alternate cut will we discuss next? Check back next week to find out. Until then, remember, physical media matters. Thanks for watching, guys. Hit that thumbs up and be kind, subscribe. <laughs>